color. This Sunday is red, and there's only one red Sunday in our calendar, so we know it's a special day. This Sunday is called Pentecost, and it's very, very red. Kind of have to wonder what is Pentecost all about? Well, Pentecost is all about a Thanksgiving feast that people go up to Jerusalem to celebrate this feast of Thanksgiving. And on this particular Thanksgiving feast called Pentecost, all of Jesus' friends had come to Jerusalem, even though Jesus was gone. So there were lots of people traveling to Jerusalem. There were families, there were friends. There were more families and more friends. There was children, there were husbands and wives, and they were all coming from far away to Jerusalem to celebrate this Thanksgiving. In this particular Pentecost feast, some of Jesus' friends were in Jerusalem to celebrate the Feast of Pentecost. And they knew the story of Jesus leaving and coming again, but sending someone special. Because when all of these people had gathered in Jerusalem, all of a sudden, a mighty wind, just like the strongest wind you've ever heard, all of a sudden started to blow. And then on each and every person, just like flames, came to rest on these people. And it was the Holy Spirit coming upon each one of God's people, coming into Jerusalem to celebrate Pentecost. And when the flames of the Holy Spirit descended on them, they were filled with the most amazing Holy Spirit. They could talk to people from other countries who spoke different languages, spoke in another tongue, but they could understand each other. And they talked of what Jesus told them the Holy Spirit was going to do. The Holy Spirit was going to comfort them forever. And the Holy Spirit was going to give them power. Power to go into the world and tell everyone about the story of Jesus. So when these friends come together and talk about the story of Jesus, he told them that the Holy Spirit gives them the power to cleanse them, to make them new, to wash their sins away, just like Jesus did for each and every one of us. So imagine being in Jerusalem and seeing all of God's people filled with the Holy Spirit, glad that they had the wonderful blessing 
of telling others all about what Jesus did for you and me. He came, he suffered for our sins, he died and was risen and sent the Holy Spirit to come upon you, to come upon me, to come upon all of us, to give us the power to share the story of Jesus, to spread that word, to cleanse our sins, because all of us mess up, but to make sure that all of us knows that the Holy Spirit, the presence of Jesus, is with us all the time, forever, in your heart, in my heart. So Pentecost is a very special day. Thank you for celebrating Pentecost with me.